A ball and a strike now to Bird. Wow, there's a pitch right there that this guy would like to have back. Very rarely do you see a pitcher of this quality throw one right oh, down the middle, and boy, he took that one. He'd like to have that one back and be able to take a good hack at that pitch. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Back goes Puig to the track, to the wall. And this one is gone, a home run. Digging in the switch hitter, Aaron Hicks. Aaron Hicks. In tight here with the first pitch fastball that's 1-0. The 1-0. Looked at for ball number two. That curveball is a pitch you have to get on top of or else it'll take off just like that one did. And he gets this fastball over. It's 2-1. and one. Into the windup. Here's the 2-1 and one pitch. Swing and a little blooper to center. Taylor coming on. He can't get to it. This one's down. Digging in now for the Yankees. Didi Gregorius. First pitch of the at bat. Now a swing and he gets him to pop it up. And that gets down and ought to be good for extra bases. Hicks rounds the corner and is headed home. He comes across to score as it's now a 2 nothing ball game. Now in the box, Neil Walker. First pitch coming, here it is. Walker. No balls and a strike to count. Gregorius takes his lead at third with one away. And that's in there as well. 0-2 oh now. This is going to be an interesting pitch right here. Does he bury something in the dirt? Does he go for the double play and give up the run? Or does he go for the... Meanwhile, this ball gets down. It's a base hit. And the runner scores from third as they extend their lead. Brandon Drury will bat know. next. Lifetime numbers against Kershaw. The pitcher's owned him. He's a paltry one for 11. He's also been a strikeout victim six times. Boy, the curveball just hasn't been there this afternoon. And this is this guy's bread and butter pitch, especially when he gets ahead of hitters. He needs to find that curveball again. Puig is over. And that's the second out of the inning. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Brett Gardner. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Breaking ball in for a strike. Three runs already home here. Can't imagine he comes back with a third breaking ball. That hitter looked like he timed that one up pretty well and just missed it, fouling it away. Here comes another 0 2. Hold the string on him. Strike three swinging. And the throw to first ends the inning. Leading off the inning, Logan Forsythe. And they'll need him to get something going here. Here's the first pitch to him. And there's one well above the zone for a ball. These are huge innings for a team's morale. The pitcher wants to go out and throw that shutdown inning up and get the boys back swinging the bats again with a chance to capitalize and even extend this current lead. And this one's high and tight backing him up two and one. Hit back up the middle. Gregorius to his left. He's there for it. Throw to first in time, and the leadoff man is gone to start the third. Center fielder number three. Digging in to try it again. Chris Taylor. He's got to be looking for vengeance after getting plunked in his last at bat. A ball of no strikes. <laughs> hey, you think the game plan is to pitch this guy inside? They plunked him in the first at bat, and they're clearly coming right back in again. A ball and a strike. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. Here's Corey Seeger. So far, 0 for 1 with a flyout. Corey set and the pitch. And that misses inside 1 and 0. Taylor, the runner at first, with one gone in the inning. Slowly hit to first. I don't think they can get two. And he is in there. He's safe. Ready for another shot now. Have Justin I? Turner. Last time up, he was hit by a pitch. Justin Turner. 
Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Sent out to straightaway center field. Hicks is under it. He's got it, and there are two down now. So that'll bring in the National League rookie home run record holder Cody Bellinger. Two on, two out for him here in the third. And he gets ahead here with the fastball. Strike one. Oh, and two. Here it is. Here's a high pop-up. Brewery waits on it. And that ends the inning. Ready for another chance? Aaron Judge as we move on Leading to the bottom of inning Andy. number three. Right. One of the keys to securing a win, they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. One ball, no strikes to count. The 1-0 home. One ball, one strike to count. It looked like from our perspective, he gave up on that one a little too quick and then tried to emergency hack late. And it's a ball and two strikes now to Aaron Judge. I think getting the leadoff man in every inning is important as a pitcher. When you're coming off an inning that you really labored through, it makes all the difference mentally. Swing and a little tapper. Now another one two. Popped him up. Bellinger ranging into shallow right. Makes the play one away. Riding in once again. Giancarlo Stanton. He got on top of one. It was a ground out victim last time. Mm, a little tardy there. No balls and a strike. Swinging strike, and now it's 0 and 2. So back to back sliders for strikes. Does he come back with yet another? There's another slider. That's back to back good sliders, and this guy's breaking ball is really good. And when he's throwing it well, like he is, and he's confident with it, he can throw it three or four times in a row. A really good slider in this one. Throw won't get him. Digging in for his second at bat, Gary Sanchez. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. There's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. And it's gone. The left-handed power bat of Greg Bird digs in now. Infield in the overshift here. Now a pitch. Swing and a high pop-up toward the stands behind third. Turner is over now and he's got it for route number two. Now with the play, Aaron Hicks. He singled his last time up. Kershaw looks in. First pitch on the way. Takes a fastball on the inside corner. Two out, nobody on. Curveball that time, not even close. Really high curveball right there. Struggling with the release point. That's the key to the curveball, figuring out and finding that release point. And the inning will continue as that's through for a two-out hit. So the bottom of the inning is still alive after the two-out base hit. So coming to the plate, Didi Gregorius. He scored after triple.